Well, just because I have to wait for the lights to come, there's really not much else for me to do. So I figure I might as well get rid of some of the other little projects I need to get done in the meantime. So let's have some fun. That's how you destroy a brand new DeWalt grinder. You use it as a grinder. Yeah, I wouldn't buy this. I'm really disappointed. Most of my tools are DeWalt. This went bad really fast. I got power. So, this one's going back.
Well, guys, that's it for today. It was just a quick video. Um, just a little messing around today. Most of my day was actually spent uh, cleaning my garage, which is no small task. My parents moved and I inherited a lot of stuff. So between that and my project messes, it was unusable. So I was able to push a GTO out today and uh, clean out a lot of the stuff I have, throwing out a lot of stuff, putting some stuff on eBay. And then I decided uh, I have an idea for next video. I'm going to take this, which is the original Quadrajet from my coach. It did run. It ran good. I had no problems with it. And uh, I'm going to rebuild it. Now, why bother rebuilding, you ask? Well, what I've decided to do is I'm going to give it away. Uh, I'm going to rebuild this Quadrajet and uh, give it away to one of my subscribers. So if you want a chance at a free Quadrajet that's been rebuilt, stay tuned, subscribe, leave a comment, send you a rebuilt Quadrajet. That's it. Enjoy, and I'll see you again soon. Remember to like and subscribe. It really does help out. I'm trying to grow the channel. I'm trying to keep myself motivated to make these videos. I do appreciate all the, the comments I do get. And uh, thank you very much. Have a good day. In case any of you are wondering, that's my 1966 GTO convertible. It's actually car number 389, which any of you Pontiac people know, that's the size of the motor as well, but that's a 389th 66 GTO built. It's got a nine inch rear in it, full tubular suspension, wheel with brakes. Basically the frame is done. All the work now is uh, body work, tail panels, floor pans, uh, put a new dashboard in it new uh, cell or filler panel in front of the dashboard because it was all rotted out. I have to change one of the pillars for the front windshield. If this is something you guys might be interested in watching too, uh, I'll be happy to make some videos for that. Let me know and uh, like I said, like and subscribe. See you later. <laughs>